this idea to do a bulletproof chat. I've got my bulletproof coffee here. Y'all should get one too. And I'm going to just kind of sit and talk about, you know, my goals for 2017. I kind of wanted to do a video that wasn't so structured. You know, here's points A, B, and C. Thanks for watching. Um, I think there are videos that definitely need to be more structured because there is information that people need to know. But I think that this is fun too. I want this channel to be um, more about like communicating with everybody and making friends because ultimately that's what I want. Um, I've made so many friends on keto and I can't tell you how happy I am that I have them in my life now. So I just want a down to earth community where we can just talk and give advice and talk about our struggles and you know our victories and just all that stuff. So my goals for 2017. Um, my first one, and it might seem kind of crazy and big, but I want to, by the end of the year, hit 100 pounds lost. And that might seem like a lot, but I've already lost right under 50. I'm hovering around that 50 pound loss for oh, too long now, but it'll come off. And I started in, in July, July 25th. So... By January 25th, I'll be on keto for six months, and hopefully by then I'll hit the 50 pounds loss. Another goal is I want to drink at least 100 ounces of water every day. And I know for me, when it gets really busy and we run around a lot, especially if we're in the car a lot, the water for me is the first thing to go. So I want to instill the importance of water in myself. You know, I think it's so important. So. That's a goal for me. Another goal for me in 2017 is to kind of start caring less about what people think. And I think I do that pretty well, um, or I put it out that I do that pretty well. Um, and you know, no haters and all that, but I think, I'm a thinker and st everything stays with me. Um, and I want to stop thinking negatively about anything. I want to not worry about, oh my goodness, I'm posting YouTube videos, what's going to happen if so-and-so from my past sees it, or this group of people that I used to be friends with, when they get a hold of it, what are they going to do? What are they going to say? I'm so embarrassed. I'm not doing that anymore. I'm not going to live in fear of what people think. I don't, I don't need to. I'm perfectly fine and I'm happier than I've ever been in my life, and the only opinions that I need are my own. Um, the people that are closest to me, and Jake. And that's it. I don't need, you know, I don't need to think about what so-and-so is going to think or say. Um, I'm happy, and, you know, I'm going to do what makes me happy, and I'm going to be bold, and I'm, I don't care. Ah, that is the soul. Okay, another goal for 2017. This might sound weird, but I want to try to do three out of seven days a week, completely dairy free. When I first started, I ate so much dairy and I got out of that, you know, I had some cheese here and there and some sour cream, but I put, you know, I was putting almond milk in my coffee and I was doing so much better, but lately it's just been dairy city for me and that's not good. I think it slows my weight loss. I think it makes me feel bad. Um, I don't know. If I have a dairy allergy, I'm not trying to self-diagnose or anything, but it's, I know it's common, a milk allergy, and I just feel better when I'm not eating so much dairy. Okay, now down to the dreaded exercise. <laughs> I am bad about exercise, and I was doing really well for a while. I would, you know, do body exercises, and I lifted dumbbells I had, and that's all gone out the window. I'm not going to sit here and say, I'm going to the gym and I'm going to do this exercise every day of the week, but I want to be more active. Um, even if that means just dancing around to hip hop YouTube uh, exercise videos, I'm down. Um, I think I'm still in the mindset of how big I was before and how unhealthy and how in pain I was. When you're that big and you're that unhealthy and you're in that much pain, 
it's just hard to do anything without hurting and without having that mental, oh, I can't do this. Um, I remember the first year that I moved to New York, so it wasn't this summer, but the summer before that, um, Jake and I went to the state fair. And the state fair here in New York is huge. And we were walking around. I was in pain, obviously. But we wanted to get on a ride. And when we got up there, the guy told us that we had to sit in a certain spot. And he didn't tell anybody else that. And I know it was because I was so overweight. But when I got over there, it was kind of high off the ground. And you had to, like, pull yourself up and jump. And I couldn't do it. It... I did eventually, but it took so long, I could not get myself up there. It was so embarrassing. Like, they were waiting to start the ride, and I'm over there, big old butterball, trying to pull myself up in the seat, and I just, and when I finally got in the seat, I was just like, please, 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 let it click down. It was just so embarrassing, but I don't want to go through that again, and I, and I don't want myself to have that mentality that... I can't do stuff like that because I've lost almost 50 pounds. Um, it's not where I need to be, but it's so much farther from what I was. I just want to do fun and active stuff, you know, go to the dog park more, um, go to trampoline parks, you know, just do anything that's fun and active and stuff that I wouldn't do before because I was so scared that I couldn't do it or that it would hurt too much or that I would be embarrassed. I'm done with that. I'm done being in my own head and being embarrassed it's just it's not happening anymore it's not how i'm gonna roll in 2017. ah oh, it's so good so those are my kind of new year's uh goals i'm not gonna call them res resolutions because i don't think that works but i want to hear y'all let me know um you know, I want to get the conversation started. Put your goals in the comments um, or put them in our group, Girls with Keto Tude. I just want just a good, strong, happy community of people who are there for each other and, you know, just friends. And that's honestly what I want. Um, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, let me know. I would love to do more videos like this, just kind of laid back and just talking to y'all. Um, oh, and I hope y'all like my new setup. I just got it all done today. No, no more floor videos. It's, I like it. I hope y'all like it. Let me know what you think, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye, y'all.